Ben! Alisa Madiba's mother collapsed and wept uncontrollably as she was brought to the house where her daughter was last seen alive. The 21-year-old student disappeared in 2013 whilst visiting a friend in this very house in Soweto. On Wednesday, the remains of a woman were found in the backyard of the Soweto resident, and while it's still unclear whether they belong to Madiba, many are speculating that this might be the case. Forensic pathologists still need to conduct DNA tests to confirm the identity of the victim. Neighbors and community members looked on in disbelief, with many horrified to learn that a woman was killed and buried right under their noses. <laughs> I don't feel safe, like, allowing our kids to visit in other homes. It's just absolute nonsense now, now that these things are happening. And knowing that we don't have trustworthy neighbours is really not, is really not nice. What they did was totally wrong, and I think that not the mother should let, be let go. She knows what was going on. She knows very well what is going on. She should also go down to hell. I really don't care. But what they did to this girl was really bad. With pain still itched on her face, Palesa's mother managed to walk out of the house unassisted and will now have to wait for DNA tests in order to find closure regarding her daughter's disappearance. Vumanim Kize, Eyewitness News, Soweto.